it's cold, it's wet. I'm here at Bletchley Station. The first class 7.30 trains are entering service today and I'm here to ride it down to Euston. Come and join me. I forgot how expensive it is to travel down here. At least I've got coffee. If it isn't the rabble. It is the <laughs> So it is half five in the morning. The train is due in in about 20 minutes time. Everybody did just get excited because they saw lights in the distance and it turned out to be a miscellaneous freight train. We know that I'm not an expert in things like that. So I'm going to carry on calling it miscellaneous freight train. I'm feeling surprisingly awake. Just me on my own today. I've been spending the weekend in London and it just so happened that I stayed in Bletchley last night. Who would have thought it? Excited to talk about this train actually. It's going to be, there's a lot of talking points. Raindrops keep falling on my head. I'm getting very, very moist. Moist, moist, my moist, my moist, my moist. I've changed my mind. I'm going to get on that one instead. Bye -bye. You know, we, we, we know I love a 350. I can see movement. There is a train coming in. Any minute now, it's going to come. This is our service to Litchfield Trent Valley. No, it's not. A purple train taking us to Euston. The original and the best purple trains. Let's get on it. This is nice. You know, I'm a big fan of my new train smell. Sadly, this won't be the kind of video where we see much out of the window. Any minute now. And our survey says, ding. <laughs> right, so the first class 7.30 to leave Bletchley. The first time I've left Bletchley as well. My experience of Bletchley so far has been, it's good to leave Bletchley. London Euston. Oh. So, I guess I've got to review the seats and stuff like that. It's a seat. It is very seat-like. It is what you might call seaty McSeat face. They're fairly standard seats, like in the class 196s. There's no armrests. This is predominantly going to be a commuter train, no. They're not, these aren't going to be spending their time going in and out of Euston, but we'll, we'll talk about that later. Um, it's a bit of a stopgap, the reason why they're here today. And that's why they're purple and orange, not green and grey. Um, plug sockets are in the place where I do not like plug sockets to be, but we just have to accept this now. Um, all in all, good, solid commuter train seats. I guess I should check out the toilets. We have dance hands, as always seem to do with toilets. It doesn't have the lock, the um, switchy lock. It's an actual lock button. It's a toilet. It's like every other train toilet. I'm not going to lie. It works. OK, let's go and have a look down the train before it gets too busy. This is actually made up of two free high units. Um, no. London North West and the West Midlands Railway like to have their gangway end doors, I think that's a technical term. And then, hey presto, we're in the back unit. I like these in units, it just gives more flexibility. Like when Northern double up their 3 free ones, you can't walk between them. You end up with one train that's really busy and one train that's really quiet. There are a few negatives though, like this table seat isn't has no window. First time I've seen a table seat with no window. So we're just leaving Cheddington, which sounds like the most British name for a village or town ever. Basically, we're stopping everywhere. Hang on, where did my coffee go? 
Nick Badley, have you stolen my coffee? Uh, yes, there you go, there's your coffee bag, my it, apologies. It was, it was bad enough, Mr. Marshall stealing my coffee at Barsh Martin or wherever it was, but now Nick Badley's at it. It tasted very good. It's becoming a tradition. <sighs> Tasty. Where are we in next, Tring? We are now approaching Tring. As we come into Tring. Find the gap when leaving the train. Uh, I honestly don't plan this. I honestly don't plan this. As we're coming into Dring, it seems like the perfect opportunity to say a massive thank you to my lovely Patreons. They're scrolling on screen right now. Massive thank you to you guys for your support. If you want to get your name onto the list, the links to do so are in the description. But thank you guys. Jim? Yes. What do you think of the new trains? I like them. I approve. Good. Found myself a little corner to talk about these trains themselves. They're part of the Adventure family of trains. Next stop will be Berkhamstead. We had a London North Western service, but that was not London North Western livery. These are actually intended for the Cross City line in Birmingham. They're going to be replacing my beloved 323s. But good news, those 323s are being moved up to um, up north. Well, some of them are anyway, so my childhood trains are getting moved to my current home. Um, they're getting replaced by these. These are a stopgap on the Southern West Coast Main Line because the 319s needed to go um, bye byes. Uh, they are going to be replaced by more suitable class 730s. That's why these are just set up for commuters in Birmingham. As much as I love the 323s, and you know how much I love the 323s, these are going to be a massive upgrade on the Cross City Line. Um, it's going to be less seats because they're not 3 plus 2 seating, but there's definitely a lot more room to stand on here, so they should be able to hold more people. Very fine coffee. Excellent. The morning is starting to catch up with me now. So this might be the slow stopper, but it's still faster than the coach that I got down here. Oh, watch this space for that video coming next week. Week after. Wasn't fun. Was not fun at all. Now we play a game of find the bins. Okay, that was actually quite easy. Sometimes on trains they're really hard to find. Like they hide them between seats and stuff. So we're just coming into King's Langley now. Play the Game of Thrones music. King's Langley, King's Landing, it's all the same. I've just noticed something. The, the, there's no see it, say it sorted announcements. How can I mop that? We're not far out of Euston now, just a couple more stops. The train is getting very busy, especially right at the front of the train. Why ostensible and came to the back where it's a little bit quieter. London, Euston, our final station. And there we go, oh, yeah, the they... first class 730 to arrive into Euston. I suppose I should go and edit this video. Thank you for watching. I'm going to leave a link here to the next video that I think you should watch. But for now, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.